Okay, so I wasn't going to do this tonight, but, and I really should be blogging, and I mean, it's only 7.45, so maybe I will, but I just want to, like, get some of my stuff organized. So, I'm just going to start to pack for Florida. Um, I'm just going to do some of my toiletries tonight, but this is my train case that I got from Kate Spade, um, probably around this time last year, because this is, like, a yearly trip that we do, um, and it just is like a huge train case. It has like this. Um, I thought there was something in it. This like little. It looks like a pencil case. But you could keep all kinds of stuff in there. You could either. I'll probably take this out. And pack this full of makeup. Um, and then this. Is a Lily Pulitzer travel case. That I got. I bought it. It was like a free gift. I think like on Black Friday they do that sometimes like they'll do like different gifts every hour and I think this was one of them but I actually bought this from on Mercari so this is their little pouches they say wear me wash me and baubles um, I do have a I just bought a Henry Bendel like jewelry case so I probably won't use this but this would be cute to just like I don't know maybe keep other stuff in and then it all just goes nicely in this little bag I like to put like my dirty um usually when I go on overnight trips like when I go to QVC I'll put my clothes in here like my dirty clothes but I won't for this trip maybe just like my socks and like underwear and stuff but I, and that's the same what I'll do for that I'll just put like my um undergarments in there but I'm not doing that yet I just wanted to take it out of my closet so this is where I keep all my foil packets and this is my trusty Kylie cosmetics case um, I got this during her birthday sale last August and it is true I've been using this like in my bag like in my work bag but it is the roomiest and you probably saw this in my hold on you probably saw it in my um, review of the Kate Spade bag but it is like the biggest makeup case it's kind of dirty but I think I'm just gonna put my toiletries in there and this is where I keep my foil packets and these are obviously what I just opened the uh, philosophy bath and bath gels and a philosophy body cream and I'm kind of just wanted to get these out of the way so I'm just gonna put these in here and that's what I'll take with me as my body wash and my body cream. And now this is just filled with stuff. But I'm, I'll am i bring a, a makeup mask. I'm just like going through and like see what things um, I'm going to buy. I'm just, what things I'm going to use. I'm just lowering my TV. So this is a Briogeo shampoo. I love Briogeo, Briogeo hair products. So that'll definitely be good to bring. Riogio conditioner, I'll bring that. I also have Orbe. Hmm. I don't know. I'm, I'm just looking to see what I have in here. I have a shit ton of stuff. The Briogeo Repair Shampoo and the Texas Tea Volumizing Shampoo. And then I'll throw in the Orbe Shampoo. I have a travel eye cream. So I have my cleanser, my makeup remover, my serum. My cleansing oil hair stuff and a little mist so that all goes in there here's my hair stuff so that looks like we're all set I'll take you along as I continue to pack and let me put these back as I continue actually yeah as I continue to pack and um and we'll see what else I come up with okay so I started packing very very when I, I can't show you this because it's not released yet secret uh, Laura Geller project so I'm gonna try to pack my makeup I packed some lippies so I'll put that away so I'm bringing two Laura Geller liquid lipsticks uh, our 50 kisses lip lock in liquid color in beige bite these are two of the best sellers beige bite and Ah, Ravishing Rose. Then, I like completely forgot that I had these two ColourPop lippy sticks in Button and 
croquet, and since they're bright colors, I figured I'd bring them. Now I have I have my nude beauty blender in there. I have two Laura Geller eye, three Laura Geller eyeliners. I don't wear eyeliner that much, but figured mine as well. This is just the Eye Care Waterproof Eyeliner in black, and then these are our Kajals, which I'm obsessed with lately, so that's why I'm bringing one in dark brown coal and deep black coal. Then I have, uh, I just have my Kylie in exposed in case I want like an ultra nude lip, even though Beige, beige Bite is a little more pinky. So then so far in the big, big, uh, train case I have my it cosmetics confidence in a compact foundation and light I thought this would be absolutely perfect to bring with me because it's so compact I have a Tarte style by Harouche palette um, and then this is a this was a limited holiday holiday limited edition palette from Laura Geller and chocolate Mer chocolate tiramisu and it's just like some nice these two shades petal and earth are so nice and then the rest are just like nice neutral shades that I'll bring and then I have my Elizabeth and James Nirvana uh, black dry shampoo um so then this is my makeup drawer obviously I have these three large so then so far in the big big uh train case I have my it cosmetics confidence in a compact foundation and light I thought this would be absolutely perfect to bring with me because it's so compact I have a Tarte style by Harouche palette um, that looks like this I didn't I bought this like off of Mercari because I it was sold out for a while and I couldn't find it but just a nice blush and some nice eyeshadows and then this is a this was a limited holiday holiday limited edition palette from Laura Geller and Chocolate Mer chocolate Tiramisu and it's just like some nice, these two shades, Petal and Earth are so nice and then the rest are just like nice neutral shades that I'll bring and then I have my Elizabeth and James Nirvana uh, black dry shampoo. Um, so then, this is my makeup drawer obviously, I have these three Laura Geller palettes that I'm obsessed with. These two you can't get anymore. This the this is this was a limited edition for our 19th anniversary on QVC blush palette, and it has all these shades. And then I have the Just Blushing palette, which was also limited edition, and it has these shades. I think because I like Golden Apricot and Tropic Hues more than the shades in here, I'm gonna bring this one. And then I have my Get Ready and Go palette, which has. Honey Sable, French Vanilla, and my all-time favorite blush shade, Honeysuckle. So this is coming with me. Then I also have to bring Gilded Honey. And then I'm also going to bring my Gelato, Liquid Gelato Illuminator in Gilded Honey. I'll bring my, um, no, I don't want to bring that. I'll bring my Mini Diamond Dust. Like, going all out for highlighters. And then I guess I'll bring, I guess it'll be a Gilded Honey. I don't want to bring too many highlighters with me. I'm going to bring, I guess I should bring, also bring, maybe I'll bring my ballerina stick. Just to have the option. So that's that. And then I'm also going to bring, oh, where is it? I'm set with highlighter. I'm set with blush. I want to bring one powder foundation. Mmm. I'm just gonna bring my balance and brighten in the shade light. Yeah, this is good. Ah! So Gilded Honey is our best-selling highlighter, so that's why I have to bring that. Diamond Dust is our new shade. I'll bring my Ballerina Stick. So that's that. Ooh, I hope I didn't show you the new thing. Okay. Um, I'm going to bring my Pure Hydrogel instead of the H2O just to get some use out of that. I have a mini Better Than Sex in my bag already. I don't think I really need anything in here. I'm not big on bronzer, so I don't think I'll bring, bring a bronzer. I think I'll just bring my Glossier Boy Brow. 
and concealer. I don't think I'm going to pack yet because I haven't decided what I want to take. So now for primer. I keep my travel size stuff in here. Oh, I need to remember to bring this. I need my mini makeup eraser. I have a small dry shampoo. I don't need that. Oh, I want to bring makeup removing pads. Not makeup removing pads. Nail polish remover pads. Just in case. This is like all um, stuff like backups. I don't need that yet. This I have to take out because I need to self tan. Oh, I have to remember to bring this and no, I don't want, I don't want my mini highlighting. Where's my mini? This is what I'm looking for. So this is the best primer ever. It's my spackle even tone. This is what I was looking for. Oh, let me take my tangle teaser. Just, so this is going in there and then I will also bring my Too Faced Hangover RX, which is the primer I just got. I'll probably also bring my NARS Tinted Moisturizer. And call it a day for that. So this stuff I can go back. This ah. Okay, this will go in my carry-on. My brush. This I'll put with my skincare stuff. We'll go in here, and how many are in here? Ten. I'm just gonna take a handful. I'll put them in there. I'll bring one, two, I'll bring four. Okay. I'm gonna put my can't see thing away. So this is what it looks like so far. I have foundation. I have to pack concealer. I have color correctors, which is what I can't show you. I have complexion. I have eyes. I have eyeliner, mascara, primer, highlighter. I think I have everything. So that might be it for, for this, which isn't that much. Oops, sorry. Which isn't that much. It's a lot less than I thought it would be. And then I have to pack my brushes, which I have to wash. And this is my Henry Benzel makeup brush case. I got this like months ago. They were like on sale and I like could not resist. I mean, it's a lot of, it's a lot, it's a lot of stuff to take with you. But look at how perfect this is. And you could stick things in here and then you have a place for all your brushes and like a little mirror. So, so cute. They have one that's just the stripes but who wouldn't take the one with the fun stuff on it? And then this is my jewelry organizer from Henry Bendel. The print is by Megan Hess, who is like my, one of my favorite, is, she is my favorite fashion illustrator. I did a post on her. I will put it in the description bar below. So this is it for now. I have to like, I have to like get my thoughts together and figure out what else I need. But for now, this is it. Okay, so in the um, throes of packing, I might as well show you what I'll show you eventually is my, how extra is this? Uh, Henry Benzel monogrammed pill box. I have a serious issue. I bought this a while ago. I probably, I've had, I've had this since the summer, I think. I think, I don't remember. Um, how extra? I wanted, do I need a pill box? No, not really, but I do have like medication that I take, so I, I think that it's like good to, I mean, why not? If you have medication that you need a pill box for, why not take it? If it's noisy, it's because I have the air conditioner on because I'm literally sweating my ass off. So I love, I love Henry Bendo. We'll get into that obsession, but I love the stripes. Like the stripes is my is my favorite it's it's the classic it's like a louis vuitton monogram like classic monogram 
um, it's just like it's classic so why not always get this like right like I have my schoolboy bag that has stripes I have a phone case that has stripes like everything from Henry Bendel has to have some sort of stripes and why not get it monogrammed Brianna Dolores Luca is my monogram BLD breakfast lunch and dinner and then inside just looks like this I have some medication in here from the last time I used it you have like the little I guess that's like I think that's like the price tag um, I don't think I paid full price for this I usually always buy things when they're on sale like I buy I shop a lot but I never pay, pay full price so I have I don't know what those pills are the this is my anxiety medication and that is just some um, an, uh, allergy medication which I really should get more of if I'm going to Florida but I'll put like my uh, anxiety medication I'll put my birth control I'll put some Advil Sprint. but how cute with a little HB so yeah that's just my little my little pill box like an 80 year old woman but how cute is it it's so cute now it's time to blog <laughs>